welcome back. If this is your first time, I'm so glad that you're here. I apologize, there is some wind, but I believe that it should be okay with my microphone, and I have been deathly sick, so <coughs> I'm going to try to do best I can. Not cough here. But the purpose of this message, this video is going to be very important for you to understand truly your life, everything you desire in life and manifestation, and how you do have to be so careful what it is that you're trying to manifest. <coughs> because it will come true. And sometimes the thing you think you desire is actually not the thing that you desire. And that's why I'm calling this. You must be careful because things are sometimes overthought and over analyzed in a sense, over drawn. We, we make them too grand over grand certain things over grand case in point a grand example is my Ventador S this is the newest Lamborghini that I've had now for uh, a little over a month like two months and I traded in my Huracan my Spider Huracan for it and boy do I regret that my Spider Huracan it was a regular Huracan Volkswagen engine basically V10 but that car was so fun. And I thought, you know, no, the Aventador is so much more amazing. It has the freaking Lambo doors. It's more badass. It's a V12. It'll be more exciting. It'll do better. And, you know, honestly, it um, it's it's my least favorite of all my cars. And it's probably the most expensive. My Rolls Royce was the most expensive. But this was the next most expensive car. And, um, yeah, I, I kind of don't like it. And... It makes me think, gosh, I shouldn't have done that. And, you know, here's the, like, there's been a lot of things in my life, you know, um, other decisions, more personal decisions I don't really want to discuss, but certain things that I've manifested or thought, and they didn't go the way, or they happened, but when I realized that they happened, maybe it wasn't what I really wanted. So really think about what is it that's going to make you happy. And here's the next thing. Be happy right now. I am so sick. The last three days, I've had 102 temperature on and off. My lungs feel like they're collapsing. My nose, my, I mean, I'm, I'm like, I work. I work like crazy. I have almost a thousand clients. I help daily. So many. I'm, I want to help another 2,000. I'm, I can literally handle thousands of clients. That's how much I love working. That's how much I love staying busy. But when I was sick like this, I couldn't do anything. I couldn't even, I couldn't get out of bed. And that made me think, you know what? The most important thing, first off, is your health and you. If your health and your mental health and your awareness is not where it needs to be, you gotta figure that out. Can you hear the wild donkeys? <laughs> The wild donkeys, they're calling to each other. I'm out here in this beautiful desert with wild donkeys. It's so awesome. I I just want you to really think, like, whatever it is you're trying to manifest. You know, the biggest, uh, funny when people are like, oh, I want to win the lottery. What is it about the lottery you want to win? Do you just want that many things? Do you want to have 20 freaking supercars? You need to have five different mansions? It's not going to bring you happiness. Pick the main thing that's going to make you happy. You know what's going to make me the most happy? I love my Rolls Royce. It's my favorite car. I love my G-Wagon. But there's this restored 69 Camaro. That's a muscle car I've always wanted. I want to listen to freaking classic rock music and that. And that, to me, is like a piece of heaven, you know? Don't even get me started with music. I mean, classic rock, music from back in the day, that is high vibe. The music nowadays is is purely purely freaking from the devil it is just the worst of the worst meant to keep you in a low vibe but we'll talk about that in a different video but this i'm not gonna make this much longer i just want you to really think about all your manifestations whether it be an sp some type of abundance whatever it is a certain place and just really don't over romanticize it don't over glamorize it in a sense and really think is this truly what i want Am I doing this for something else? Am I doing it for 
this or that or just really think about it you know i'm not saying the aventador is a bad car really i'm still grateful for it but i am um, yeah i just don't know how long i'll keep it i don't know it um it just didn't bring me what i thought it would bring me so remember that with your manifestations most importantly love yourself and have every day having health be the forefront of your manifestation and your life i love you my friend have a wonderful day and i will see you in the next video